Hey class, this is the exercise from the book on tables. So um, the first exercise was to, on page 132, is to create a table from existing copy. And so basically we take a Word document um, that has no table in it and then you place it into InDesign and create the table from scratch. And um, using the existing information. And it's really cool how easy it is. I'm really excited to show you. And then also creating these alternating cell colors and then um, how to set up tabs. Here, let me put on my hidden characters. Let's see if it'll let me put on my hidden characters. Oh, if I'm in preview mode, that's one thing. A little pointer. If you're in preview mode, because if I switch the W to preview and normal, then you can't see the hidden characters even if they're show supposed to be showing. So I have to constantly remind myself, am I in preview mode? Okay, yes, now I'm not. And then we also added um, different borders, one around the outside, which is dashed, and then the borders on the inside, as you can see, are white. So you have that flexibility to adjust them differently. And so we're going to go over that. And also centering um, the information within the cells, and then also merging cells, because the top cell, three cells were merged together. So it's fairly easy. So I'm going to go over all of that in this tutorial, starting from scratch. So first, create a new document, file new. It really doesn't matter what size. Um, just use the default, like letter sizing, half by 11 with um, 0.5 margins. Yes. Okay. And then the, the actual table that we're going to create um, is going to go inside a frame. So first, we need to draw the frame with our frame tool. Okay, and um, I, it says it's, um, I just drew one right away, and then you can always change the size, so 2.5 inches by 4 inches is what it's supposed to be, so I'm going to go up to the width and height and just type it in, 2.5 inches, and then hit tab to go jump down, and now it's the right, the white width, now the height is supposed to be four, so I hit four space inches and then hit return to get out of that. And that's the size of the frame. And then we're going to put the text, place the text into the frame. Okay, so you guys remember it's either go file place or command D or control D, depending on if you have a Mac or PC. So um, where is it? Oh, time machine wants me to back it up. Mm, tabs. Tabs, 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 tabs. Can't remember what this thing was supposed to be. Oh yeah, grade scale is the grade. Okay, so open up 05 grade scale in your artworks, 05 art and resources folder. And then it just places the word information without the table. But if you turn on your hidden characters, let me make sure I'm in, am I in preview mode? Yeah, I'm in normal mode. So then hidden characters, turn on hidden characters. So that's um, command, Option I for a Mac or Control Alt I for a PC. Zoom in. Okay, hidden characters are there. And then to turn this into a table, it's really easy. But first, you know, if you were setting up the document in Word, you need to make sure that there's a tab here between each, because the tab is going to turn into the cell. So every time you hit tab, it jumps to the next cell. And then whenever you see the paragraph symbol, it's going to jump to the next row. So that's how it converts regular text into table. And then to do this, you have to make sure you're in your type mode, I think, to pull up the option. And go table, convert table, text to table. Okay, and then here it goes, um, column separator is with a tab, like I was saying. And then the row separators are going to be with all the paragraph symbols. So it's going to convert now. Oops, I only had some of the text highlighted, so it only converted the text that I had highlighted, but you can see where it's going. Let me go back, Control or Command Z to go Edit Undo, and then uh, make sure you have all your text highlighted. The shortcut is um, Command A, or you can go Edit, um, edit, er, edit, Select All, Select All, yeah. Select All is Command or Control A, and then, um, and I just unselected it. Wow. <laughs> okay, control A and then convert to table. Uh, um, table, convert to text to table. 